TV. So I've gotten a couple requests to do an eye makeup tutorial or wanting to know how I do my eye makeup. So I'm going to a wedding right now and I thought it would be a perfect opportunity to show you how I do this smoky eye. Okay, so to start this look, you're going to want to apply a primer across your eyelid. I'm going to apply it all over my lid. Next, I'm going to take my MAC blending brush, number 224, and I'm going to apply soft brown, which is a color by MAC, but you can use any neutral brown. I'm going to use the same brush to apply Chocolate Swiss, which is also a MAC eyeshadow. I have small eyes and kind of small lids, so I use this technique to create dimension and kind of open my eye. I am using MAC paints. I like to use this paint for a very dramatic effect. The color is called Graffito, and I use MAC's brush number 242SE to apply it. I apply it by patting on the pigment, and this is how I like to apply my eye shadow, especially if I want the pigment to pop, as opposed to brushing it back and forth, which tends to make more of a mess. But you can use any really dark eyeshadow, any black eyeshadow by any brand. And I'm going to just simply pat on the pigment to the lower lid and extend it upwards into the crease. So I'm applying this pigment as close to the lash line as possible. Next I take a angled shadow blending brush and I'm using Sephora's actually and it's number 20 and I'm using this to blend in the crease so that there are no sharp or harsh lines that I've just created. And I'm also going to use the same brush to apply some eyeshadow by MAC. It's called Print and it's a dark gray. And I'm going to apply it again in the crease of my eye. After that, I'm going to take Laura Mercier's eyeliner brush and it has two ends, one flat and one pointed. And I'm going to apply the same MAC Paint pigment underneath my eye. And if you don't like to use eyeshadow as eyeliner using a brush, you can simply use a black eyeliner pencil. That's totally fine. In fact, I'm going to use a black eyeliner pencil by Smashbox. It's called Limitless Eyeliner in Onyx. And I'm going to apply it to the upper and lower waterline. Next, I just take a small blending eyeliner brush and I'm going to apply Chocolate Swiss, so the same color we used above the crease, and kind of blend in the eyeliner that I've just put on. I like to highlight underneath my brow using Rice Paper by MAC, and I just take a flat brush and kind of pat just underneath my entire eyebrow. Again, I take my blending brush by MAC and I blend in, using small circular motions, all of the eyeshadow so that there are no harsh lines. I'm going to take the smudge brush and apply rice paper, which is the same eyeshadow I used underneath my brow, to the corners of my eye. When I'm done applying my eyeshadow, I usually take a makeup wipe and use one sweeping motion to just remove makeup residue that has fallen to underneath my eye. I'm going to apply my favorite concealer, which is by Makeup Forever. It's HD High Definition Concealer. And I usually apply it with a brush or even my finger. And it's very moisturizing, so it doesn't show a lot of lines underneath my eye, which I like. And shoot, I forgot lashes, so I'm going to have to make do with my own. And I like to use Makeup Forever Smoky Lash, and I'm applying it to my upper and lower eyelashes. Now my lower eyelashes are kind of long, so what I like to do is take my finger and dab any excess mascara that may be on my lower lashes. And I also like to blow so that it dries completely because otherwise if it touches my skin, it's going to obviously leave a smudge. 
Lastly, I like to comb my eyebrows with Fix Mascara Waterproofing Seal by Clarins, and it just kind of brushes them and keeps them um, intact. And that's it. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Let me know if you want to see any more looks, and I'll be happy to post them. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.